Welcome back for another day of teen numbers with the count. Today, our number of the day is the number 13. This will be our focus for today, the number 13. This is the number 13. Clap it. 13. Stomp it. 13. Cheer it. 13. Whisper it. 13. Now turn on your magic writing fingers so we can practice drawing the number 13 in the air. Turn on your magic writing finger. So for a 13, we write a 1 and a 3. So start with your 1, start at the top, go all the way to the bottom. Whoop. Now jump back up to the top for our 3, and we go around the tree, around the tree. That's the way you make a 3. So once you are done, shout yippee for 13. Write a 1. And a three. Once you are done, shout yippee. Let's do it one more time together, boys and girls. Start at the top. Straight line down. Whoop. And our three. Around the tree. Around the tree. Once you are done, shout yippee. How about on the carpet or on the floor? Make a one and then a three. Around the tree. Around the tree. Once you're done, shout yippee! Now for our challenge, can you find all of the number 13s? Ready, set, go! Okay, let's see. Were you able to find all of the 13s? Looks like there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, thirteens. Did you find them all? Now we're going to practice counting 13 objects. We're, again, we're going to line them up so we count them one at a time, counting by ones. Here we go, count with me, please. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Now we have thirteen carrots. The number thirteen is a two digit number. The number 13 is 10 and three more. We can also say it in a number sentence. 10 plus three equals 13. You'll see in our chart over here, we have one group of 10, a tower of 10, and there's one. And then on the one side, we have three ones by themselves. So 10, and we can count on 11, 12, 13, 10, and three more make 13. Now we're going to use our circle map to brainstorm some ways to make 13. We'll start with our number bond. If we're using a number bond to make the number 13, our 13 goes on the top because it's our biggest number. And we break it up into 10 and three. 10 and three make 13. 13. We can decompose the number 13 with 10 and 3. We can also use a number line to show the number 13. So we start on 10 and we jump three times. One, two, three. And then we land on the red dot, which is 13. 10 and three more. Three jumps makes 13. We can use our number sentence, 10 plus 3 equals 13. We can use our rack and rack. We move 10 over on the top and then 3 on the bottom to make 13. 10 and 3 more make 13. We can use our unifix cube so we have a stack of 10 and then we count on 3 more, 10, 11, 12, 13. 
And same thing with our 10 frames. So we have one 10 frame all filled, but then there's some left over. So we have 10 and then three more to make 13. Now again, you can click the next link to watch the Sesame Street number of the day video for the number 13. It's linked in Schoology and here on YouTube in the playlist. Great job, boys and girls. See you tomorrow.